Hey everybody, like I said in the last video, the oldest daughter has a new place to live. And you know what that means, don't you? I got a new place to go metal detecting. Oh yeah, the RV has moved. Very cool. There's baby smudge. What is its name really? Braylon. It's, gonna be, it's a girl. It's a girl, his name is Braylon. And when do we do? November 30th. You're gonna make me a fucking grandpa. Yes. <laughs> It's hard to believe, too, for me, I know. Uh, you know how bad of a grandpa I'm going to be. I know. I mean, you know, I'm going to be spoiling baby smudge with sugar treats and getting her all loaded up and sending you home. I know. I already know. <laughs> all right, she's going to go play in her house for a while, and I'm going to go dig some holes in her yard, and I'll show you why here in a second. You see, when we were helping her move in, I happened to notice... All of this red brick out here, yeah, that's nice. But anyways, there's all this red brick just kind of washed out. That looks like some slate, maybe a slate roof. A lot of fucking garbage in here. Look at this. Oh, that's awesome. Fucking marble. I haven't found a marble in forever. So, is this fill dirt? There's some pottery. Is this fill dirt? Or is this an old home site that's been knocked down? This is where I will be working today. Very awesome. <laughs> I love having my RV. I can get out and go do stuff now. I'm excited. I already got a good find. It is supposed to be a penny. Let's check it out. I have a feeling it's going to be big iron. And all kinds of red coming up here. Nope, it's actually going to be a penny. And... Wow, what is it? It is a wheat penny. Fucking <laughs> awesome. First target of the day. All right, let's see what this one's going to be. It's supposed to be an 86, which is more like a clad quarter. That's exactly what it's going to be. A fucking clad quarter. I'm so excited. <sighs> Got to be some silver in here. A lot of junk in here. This is another high tone. Could be clad quarter. Check it out. It was down a bit deep, so who knows. Bass junk. Yep. Fuck. There it is. Deep junk. Yay. I'm so excited. Wow, could this actually be a whole bottle? It's small enough to survive. So it did it. Oh, yes, it did. Interesting. What is that down there? I don't know what it says on the bottom. Dot dot eight. Hmm. It is a screw top, so we're not talking 18th century. We're talking early 20th. Which fits with just about everything else I've been finding. It is interesting. You know the brick. Well, I don't know. That's red brick right there. Wow, where'd it go? It's a low tone. I mean, it's a soft tone. It means it could be deep and big. And it is. Interesting. What is it? Oh, 
Fucking money clip. No money. God damn it. Yeah, I don't even see anything here that looks like paper. It's interesting. Would be nice if it was at least silver. Look at that. Looks like marble number two. Is it going to be? Fuck, it's busted. Damn it. <sighs> That's too bad. That would have been a pretty one. Oh well. Well now that's a weird find. It is a dime, Roosevelt, however, super ultra thin and worn down on the edges, a lot like the dimes I find on the beach. However, I'm not on the beach. I'm about 40 miles from the beach, so what the fuck? Let me grind on this. Let me see if it's clad or if it's uh, silver. Well, because a beach dime a silver beach dime would look that color. Let me give it a shot. Nope, it looks like it's definitely going to be red on the edge. If it were silver, of course, it would just grind down to a pure white. This is how I do beach dimes, and that's what it looks like. And what the fuck? Well, that's going to conclude today's hot and sweaty exploration. Here, definitely looks like building material. Here. It's nothing. And way down at the end of the driveway, more of the same material. Fill dirt. In the yard itself, I don't get a hell of a lot. <sighs> it looked good for a minute. So I'm going to head back and get my ass back in air conditioning. Hope you guys had a little bit of fun. At least I have the RV now. I can get out to even stupid little sites like this. I'm excited. That's why I bought the damn thing. To go have some fun. I'm tired of sitting at home. I mean, there's only so much internet porn you can watch. Am I wrong? <sighs> Alright, boys and girls. I'm out of here.